if you knew when you started in real estate investing, what you now know today, what would you do different? Uh, I would have done two things differently. I would have, well, the outcome would have been different, but I would have gotten into masterminds, to groups, to circling, to putting myself in uh, arenas of like-minded, similar goal people. And then I'd educate myself through that arena and I would have gone to commercial real estate investing earlier versus later. And why would you have gone into commercial earlier than later like you did? Yeah. The dollars. I mean, it, everything's bigger in my mind. It's not to say it's easier. It's just different. I, I say for the, for the juice, it's easier, meaning the squeeze is about the same and the juice is better. If would you say sense. your commercial uh, would you say your commercial projects are more about building long-term wealth than say comparing to a uh, fix and flipper house or are you flipping commercial projects? Uh, that's a good question. So they are primarily focused on long term and you know part of that is that one house can only get you so far. So for one for for it to equal, you know, one building in a portfolio, I need 10 or 20 houses. And at some point the management is, is just so different between the two. And don't hear me, don't hear, hear me right. I do all of it. You know, I'm, we're in a, we're in a business from, from what I do, from what my team does is that we're, I call us a deal source. So we're trying to identify value, whether that be in single family home, duplexes, triplexes, fours, or eights, whatever it may be, or into the warehouses to, to office buildings, wherever the value is, we're trying to identify that and and find ways to, to capture that and then put it into place, find, figure out the best exit strategy because every piece of property has a different best exit strategy. Yeah, what you just said reminds me of something my uh, father told me when I was 24 years old. He said, Jay, today you've got to work for your money. But as quickly as you can, put a plan in place to where your money is working for you and you have the choice as to whether you want to get up for that day job. So I know what you're talking about. Another one of my favorite questions, Neil, to ask my guests is, as you look back over your real estate investing career, I help real estate investors raise private money for their deals. So if you would like to have unlimited funding for your deals, regardless of what your background is, et cetera, but being able to get all the private money you would want. And I'm not talking hard money. I have got a brand new, just written hot off the press money guide that you can download absolutely for free and you can get it right now. It's titled seven reasons why private money will skyrocket your real estate business and help you in build incredible wealth. Go right on over right now to www.jayconner.com forward slash money guide, and it will put you on the path to getting all the funding you need right now for your real estate deals. Get it at www.jayconner.com forward slash money guide. Download it right now. Yeah.